Okay, here's the jack shaft set up on the racing tractor, uh, and I'm going to explain it real quick. It's made out of a three-quarter inch piece of stainless. It's mounted to two flange mount bearings that connect to my supports that are welded to the frame. To service it, uh, pull these belts or bearings, you just take these two screws out and then the bottom two and the whole shaft comes out uh, and everything can be swapped out. Um, the reason that I made it a little bit longer like this where the bearings, you know, the, the support here could have come down lower. Um, if I was using a thinner shaft, I would have made it shorter, but that's why I used this three-quarter inch so that I could make it longer so that the pulleys can slide up and down on this shaft. If I was going to use like a three-tier pulley back here uh, so I can adjust my speeds on that belt uh, and then just adjust my tensioner over here, um, I, I'd be able to do so. And same with the motors. If the cranks were longer or whatever, I always have the ability here to move this pulley up and down. And I left the walls here nice and far away from the pulleys, so if I wanted to change sizes and stuff, the the walls of these supports wouldn't get in the way. And they are definitely plenty strong. Uh, with a three and a half inch, even with a twelve or a three and a half horsepower, a twelve horsepower, I don't think could could do any damage here. So uh, that's just how I how I made mine. You could make yours different, but that should give you a good idea how they're done.